Yeah, I think it was really misunderstood, uh, misconstrued. Sometimes when I'm speaking, like, I'll be speaking to my boys, I'll be like, ah, guy, you're deaf now, guy, how far you know, guy. Like, so it wasn't anything deep? Yeah, so it wasn't like, I didn't actually mean like, oh, babe, you're actually stupid. Like, one of my boys from London, he was like, yo, that he was watching it one time, and, um, I was speaking to her and I, I think I said something, apparently I said something like, um, um, you know, you're, at, you're actually a fool. And he was laughing like, I know Shakes is joking, but I don't know if Nigeria can actually know that he's joking. So like, it wasn't like that. Um, we had three disagreements in nine weeks, by the way, where um, that will happen in relationships. Um, I'm open to learning. I'm open, I'm open to people advising me for however they think my relationship could be better. Um, that's my best friend and really and truly like, I do everything to treat her the best way I know how. Um, I really try to show that. I don't know why it wasn't aired on screen. All right, so you mentioned uh, meeting her people, getting an apartment. Is that going to be happening now you're outside of the house? Yeah, like, I think Bella needs to come out. But for me, like, that's actually my best friend. Like, for real, oh, for real, for real. Like, okay. I'm not even, I know, like, I, you know, I, I keep saying this, and I, I don't know if people even want me to say this, but I think it's so disrespectful to her that people ask if it was a strategy, like, because you find babe like that not falling in love like i'm so confused like she got me so coming outside and hearing all of this i'm like wow like this is actually shocking because that's really my guy that's really my person for real for real for real all man right and speaking about your person our shakes there's a story about you having an ex-girlfriend just before you came into the house now several times you threatened to go back to her when you and bella fell out was that real or you were just trying to put her on her toes no, I think that um, I've been I've been told a lot of stuff about different stories that've been going around. What I will say is that um, I've gone through heartbreak before, so sometimes maybe if things were tough between Bella and I, I just naturally I'm just defensive. scared. Like, I was just scared of like my heart being broken. I probably just thought, you know, ah, come on, if I jack right now and I leave this relationship quickly, then maybe I wouldn't be so heartbroken if things went wrong. So um, that was just that, man. Like Bella's really my guy. Um, I keep hearing about different stories. My name hasn't been mentioned in any video. I don't know why different things are being attached to me. Um, I'm waiting for my bestie to come home and we just figure it out, man. All right. Uh, speaking about figuring something out very quickly, it seemed like there were uh, a lot of housemates against you at some point. It felt like they were always coming for you. And you said not to get along with a lot of them. How did that make you feel while you were in the house? Um, I don't think that's true, you know. Like, I feel like a lot of housemates, I'm actually close to them. They're actually my people. Um, you know, sometimes you could disagree with someone and um, like in the real world you disagree with someone today and then a couple of days later you guys are cool and you're back to being normal um, it's funny so but when you're on television people actually take that and think that you and that person like suddenly hate each other um, I think Bella and I spent so much time together that sometimes we was basically detached from the rest of the group um, so now nah, like I got love for the rest of the 27 housemates I'm wishing everybody the best I'm out with my boys you know what I'm trying to say I'm from day one you already know Groovy was my roomie yeah, I'm sure people saw Hermes and I bond earlier on and sometimes we had disagreements which is normal and the boys are back man you And there was one back. disagreement between you and Groovy and it was mm. because of the lady <laughs> Groovy, here's yeah. your life What happened? What, what went on? Because there was a bromance yeah. and we saw that shake for it, even if it was a minute Why was that? Um, I think I think because because um, uh, because our personalities are, you know, are so similar it was obvious that we would, we would obviously want to stand up for our women and um, yeah, it, it kind of broke up because of an altercation because uh, between um, uh, Bella and Tina, and uh, you know the argument, you know, turned into you know insults okay. and there. Um, and and I feel like you know he he felt it best to stand up for his woman, and uh, you know I did the same. And but everything's fine now, yeah, right? Everything is fine. We didn't even All have right. to sit down to have an argument, man. Shakes, oh, Shakes is my great. guy. He's a genuine guy. Like he really, you know, he really loves his girl. And obviously, like whatever it is that's happening in the house, it's a three four show, as we always say, not yeah. everything can be shown, you know. So, you know, I feel like this whole relationship matter, you know, about what we're doing in the house, you know, I feel like we should just, we'll you know, out people, yeah, you know, a proportion yeah. bigger, you know, we should just move past it. And obviously, I, I okay. believe it's rooted for his girl just as much as rooting for right. mine. Speaking yeah. about Shag, Shag, what do we expect to see now you're outside of the house? You know, like, I was acting before I went in the house, so I, really? shot, a, I shot a series that's dropping soon. Uh, I'm just trying to make my mark as a big actor um so i'm gonna shoot more stuff um, i play football as well so i've been a footballer since i signed for the first professional team i signed for i was 13 years old in england when that happened i've got a serious injury right now so i'm gonna have an operation and then i'm gonna talk to my agent in england and decide if it's the right route for me to get back into football or if i'm just gonna retire early 
Um, you know, I also just want to be a brand influencer and I want to influence young Nigerians. You can be different, you can be a mix of London and Lagos, you could hear London, you get, you can be tied up, you can have You know, earrings. people gave you the name Mr. Ikoyi. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Mrs. Ikoyi, you see on her way up. <laughs> All right, so guys, very quickly, we're going to open up the phone lines and we're doing that for just five minutes. So if you're listening and your face are in the studio, yes, you can call them now. There's a number on WhatsApp. You can get to text us, call in by WhatsApp. That's fine. The number to do that with is 0809-234-5913. For the ladies, your line is 0809 19